All right, guys, welcome back to another Reacts video. Today, I am very, very excited to be doing this reaction video because it's of one of my favorite players at the Bulldogs at the moment. Much to the probably excitement of you Doggies fans, it is Preston Mania reacting to Jacob Preston highlights. These highlights are from his 2020 season with the Bears and then 2021 from the Roosters. Let's get into the Mania. So the Roosters stuff is going to be flag, and then the Bears stuff would be ball, I assume, or it could both be flag. And he'll be the second row, obviously, as he hits a hole there against the Panthers as well. Looks inside, scores the try. I hate seeing him in the Roosters kit, though, to be fair. He's going to hit that hole there against the Tigers, who he carved up on the weekend. I'm so glad he's, you know, in the Bulldogs blue and white now because I love him so much. Crashes over there for a try. And, oh, offload. Try time. As a Doggies player, not so much these highlights, but what he's done for the Bulldogs so far, he reminds me a lot of Josh Jackson. <laughs> Breaks the whole inside ball. That was good ball playing, which is promising, because at the NRL level so far, some of the passes he's thrown good hole there. Some of the passes he's thrown have been questionable, to be honest. But, like, he's just such a quality play. He seems to be able to do a bit of everything. And he's just, like, a workhorse, doesn't mind contact. And yeah, as I, like as I was saying, he just reminds me of Josh Jackson a lot. In just like he's a workhorse, he'll get through like lots of carries, lots of defense. But, uh, speaking of defense, there's a great tackle there. And he just seems to have that Bulldogs DNA inside of him, which is like he's not a Bulldogs junior. Obviously, he's a Roosters junior, but I like watching him play and I love his haircut. He's got the mullet going. Nice. He looked inside and then hit outside. That was nice. It's good stuff. Shout out to that center. He's got a nice haircut as well. It seems like he's playing a lot of left edge here as he busts a bunch of tackles. Good carry. He, it seems like he's playing a lot of left edge here. Where, obviously, at the Bulldogs at the moment, he's he's starting second row because of a couple of injuries. But he's starting on the right side because we have kick out on the left. And, like, he's doing a job on the right. So, it's good to see that, you know, he can probably play both sides. You know, maybe if he's benched late in the game and then kick out once a rest, he can go on and play that left edge back rower. I've seen a lot of people as well calling for him to play um, lock. So I wonder if he can play lock. I'm not sure. From what I've seen, well, in these highlights, it seems like his ball playing is really good. But and a good try again. Uh, but from what I've seen, you know, in the two or three games he's played... He's, there's a lot of passes that are going to ground stuff, and obviously that comes with, like, you know, your centre being in the wrong sport or just, like, pressure on you and stuff like that, and obviously those combinations will build, but I don't know if I see him as a lock yet. There's a, that's a Josh Jackson-style tackle. That is exactly what I'm talking about. He's got the head tape as well here. He should, he should tape his head for the Bulldogs. That'd be mad. Yeah, I, I don't know if I see him as a lock yet. I think he can definitely... There's potential there for him to play lock, but I like him as a back rower at the moment. I'd assume that when, you know, Luke Thompson and Tavita come back from injuries, he'll go to the bench and come on as a second rower. But, man, I like him as a starting second rower. I really like what I've seen from him in the NRL and then in these highlights as well. Look at, like, look at that. Like... He's just a he's just a good quality football. He's, he's a footballer, this kid. Oh, that was a good ball from the half. In the words of Steve Blocker Roach, he's a footballer, this kid. Preston Mania. And before the video ends, not only am I giving a shout out to Preston Mania, Jacob Preston, I'm also giving a shout out to Pickle Bet. If you're ever gonna have a bet, you know maybe you want to bet on Jacob Preston to score any time try score. I know I've done that a couple of times this year. If you're going to do that, make sure you're doing it with Pickle Bet. The link is in the description, but if you are going to do it, do it responsibly. Don't Maybe bet on him to score one try. Don't bet on him to score five or six tries. That's irresponsible. That's not responsible betting. We want to be betting responsibly and only do a bet, only sign up to bet if you're 18 or older. But yeah, shout out to Pickle Bet. Shout out to Jacob Preston. Preston Mania. Let's trot, baby.